today I want to show you how you can upgrade to Windows 11 entirely for free and also whether or not your PC meets the minimum system requirements. Obviously, it's better if your PC meets the system requirements, but if it doesn't, there's a workaround. Windows 11 officially released on October 5th, and you can now upgrade to the release build. Alright, let's jump into it and see what this is all about. Before we upgrade to Windows 11, you would probably want to check, is your computer even capable of running Windows 11? To find out, head to the following website. In here you will have to click on download PC Health Check app and install the application in your computer. Choose where to save the application, open the file that you just downloaded, accept the terms and conditions and install the application. Once the installation is complete, you will open the app and check if your PC meets the minimum requirements. To do it, you have to click on check now, and in this case, this PC meets the Windows 11 requirements. If that's your case, going back to Windows updates, you will find a sign like this that says that you can now install Windows 11, so you just have to download and install the package and wait a few hours for everything to install correctly. Accept the terms and conditions, and as I say, wait a few hours. If your PC qualifies but you don't see the option to download and install, you can go to this website. Here you can find the link of this website and you can also find it in the description of the video. And there are three options below for installing or creating Windows 11 media. Check out each one to determine the best option for you. Okay, so the three options are these ones. Windows 11 Installation Assistant. This is the best option for installing Windows on the device you're currently using. Click Download Now to get started. So you can also read this before installing. And then you have to click on Download Now. The second option is Create Windows 11 Installation Media. If you want to perform a reinstall or clean install of Windows 11 on a new or used PC, Use this option to download the media creation tool to make a bootable USB or DVD. And the third and last option is download Windows 11 Disk Image ISO. This option is for users that want to create a bootable installation media USB flash drive DVD or create a V-roll machine, an ISO file, to install Windows 11. This download is a multi-edition ISO which uses your product key to unlock the correct edition. So you will be wondering what does this means? Well, this is the option for you if your PC doesn't meet the minimum requirements to install Windows 11, because with this option you will bypass all these system requirement checks. So are there any downsides? Well Microsoft has stated that you might not get security or driver updates if you take this path. And the last thing you have to do is just select the product language, in this case is English, and then click on confirm. Now all you have to do is click on download, choose where to save the download, and install Windows 11. If you don't have Windows 10, so you aren't able to upgrade from Windows 10 to 11 for free, you can visit our website and get Windows 11 at special prices. You can also get Windows 11 Home, Windows 11 Pro Edition and Windows 11 Enterprise Edition. So don't hesitate to visit our website and get one of the Windows 11 options for you or your family. And that's it for today. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments. If you want to keep watching and learning from more videos, please subscribe to our channel and don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.